The wife of Akwaibom State Governor Mata Udomimanu has donated two newly built houses to two widows in the state under her social welfare scheme. An empowerment social welfare program and family empowerment and youth reorientation program. The two beneficiaries are MM David, and she's a mother of three from Isienudem local government area, and Ofonime Harrison, another mother of three from Uyo local government area. While donating the houses to the two beneficiaries, the First Lady charged them to not to lose hope in life, noting that her social welfare scheme was established to cater for such less privileged individuals in society. Because of how God does his things, he made it possible for Commissioner for Works to go on this exercise that day. In the course of that assignment, we came across a widow who was living in a portal cabin as reflected there. And our due for compensation was a hundred thousand. And having paid her, and we were about to do demolition, I saw three young children who were not obvious, who were not aware of their environment, running out of that little portal cabin. So we couldn't take down the structure, and it was out of compassion. I reached out to FERC that we could, in collaboration with FERC, build her a house because officially it was not possible to adjust a compensation of 100,000 to become 5 million or more. For M.M. David, a 40-year-old widow with three kids in Itu, Ikorek Bayong, in a Sinudam local government area of Akwaibom State, whose living condition was extremely appalling, what she could only dream of came to reality. God has given her a home. A beautiful home. The Family Empowerment and Youth Orientation programs have provided shelter and other life-touching services to hundreds of less privileged women and children in Akwaibom State since its inception in 2015.